Did you get my messages? Oh. Yeah? I'm coming with you. Is that okay? You are. Huh? Speak French or you're joking, aren't you? Oh, I don't care about Gina. Sister can look after her from now on. Yeah, well, she sorted us out of this house, but it's like 10,000 miles away. Remember, the one I was telling you about. Horrible stuck up bitch that she is. Yeah, well, it's her turn now. Let her see what it's like. Right, right, yeah, okay. All right, I'll see you. Yeah. <laughs> Bonjour. <laughs> Tim! Who was that? Just a mate of mine. You off to France? Might be, why? For how long? No offence, but what is it to you? Because you're staying in my house. I thought it was Sally's. What, that stuck-up bitch that's just sorted somewhere for the pair of you to live? The one who's gonna look after Gina from now on? Well, it's about time. What? Well, he's the one who's been looking after her for God knows how long. Me? On my own. So, yeah, it is about time that Sally pulled away. And what are you doing with her bags? You see, she told Sally that it was her. What? And you knew, didn't you? But there's more to it than that, isn't there? Look, I don't know what you're talking about. I've got to go. She said that she can't remember doing any of it. You told her what she'd done. <laughs> What's I supposed to do? She wasn't taking her medication. I could hardly sell her down the river. So I've got it sorted. I said, if you'd stop sending them text messages, then I won't say anything. She did, so I kept quiet. Sally wondered why she couldn't recognise her voice when she made those pretend calls from the hospital. Or maybe she held her nose. Or maybe it was you. What? Maybe that's why she can't remember doing it. Maybe that's why she's so confused. She did it because she's confused. She wouldn't hand deliver a pig's heart. She ain't got it in her. It's too much effort. But you... You think it was me? I think you sent those messages. Give me back. Hello? Hello? Sally. Tim? 